Marcela Aguayo. I have been dancing since I was 19, so right out of high school. So from there, I just got infected with the flamenco bug <laughs> and haven't stopped ever since. I can't. There's periods of time where I haven't danced, where I just, it's like I don't even know who I am. So, <laughs> I have to keep doing it. The hardest thing for me is that there's so much to learn. Even professionals, you know, that are in Spain, they say that we'll always be students. But it's a lifelong art form, so you're just always going to be learning. And that's something that makes, makes us all so humble, because there, there's always going to be someone that knows, like, a little more than you, or you know, can get things out a little better. But it's just, it's so, it's such an honor to just be on stage. And that's, that's what makes it all worthwhile. The great thing about El Cid is that we have different groups. Every Thursday it's my group. On Fridays we have Manuel Gutierrez, who's amazing. On Saturdays we have Angelita's group, and she's been here since the 80s. as more of a traditional show. And on Sundays we have Wendy Castellanos and her group. And it's just, it's great because you're never going to see the same show twice. Even if you come every Thursday, you're going to see different things happening. So it's awesome. There's so many elements of flamenco, but the, the main thing is that it's an improvised dance form. So it looks like it's rehearsed, but it's really everyone tuning into each other. Everyone has to be paying attention to each other. If the guitarist starts playing something different, I have to be listening to him and make sure that I resolve at the same time that I can feel his guitar getting lower or, or different things happening. And we have to, everyone has to pay attention when you're doing the clapping, it's not just clapping, you know, it's, it's a 12 count rhythm uh, for some of the dances we do. There's four counts and, and 12 counts. So they're intricate uh, rhythms that come from all kinds of different places in the world. And we're so lucky to, to have it here in LA in this historic building. This has been here for over 100 years. Um, you're going to experience passion coming from each performer. And that's something that is interesting to, to capture. You know, it's, it's always going to be different. And you, just, you can come here and just forget about the world for a minute and just watch the story that's happening. Watch and listen to the story. 